I would like to talk to you about a topic that must be a priority for leaders and particularly leaders of organizations today. The role of business in driving solutions to the climate challenges we face globally. Climate change, after all, impacts every business in every sector, function, business line and geography. Why business? For many decades, business has been a tremendous force for good in the world. It is an engine that has lifted billions of people out of poverty, created jobs, improved standards of living, and delivered valued products and services. It is uniquely poised to help address the urgent challenges of climate change in an economically sustainable way. Business leaders are, after all, entrepreneurs and problem solvers capable of a wide range of partnerships. Let me go so far as to say I cannot see progress being realized on climate without business. Business can play a critical role in discovering, developing, scaling, and achieving meaningful solutions to the problems of climate change we have seen so acutely in recent years. This is why Harvard Business School has followed a differentiated approach toward climate issues that simultaneously considers climate policy, energy policy, and economic policy. It is why we are thinking deeply about how best to transition to a greener economy. It is why we take a multi-pronged approach to climate issues, renewable energy, electrification, carbon capture, decarbonization, mitigation, and adaptation. And it is why we are doing important research and writing cases on how to help companies achieve the commitments they have made to net zero emissions. This is also why Harvard Business School is leveraging our strong platform and emphasizing the importance of climate change as a business topic. A growing number of faculty colleagues are doing important work that looks at climate issues from vantage points as diverse as leadership, financing, workforce development, incentive alignment, and carbon accounting. This has yielded many new cases, books, articles, courses in the MBA program, and programs in executive education and HBS online, such as Unlocking Growth with Climate Change Innovation and Business and Climate Change. Additionally, we are deeply committed to disseminating this work to reach a broad audience. Here, we are leveraging our Harvard Business Publishing platform to share insights with educators and practitioners around the world. Similarly, HBS Working Knowledge provides a weekly window into early stage work. And our Climate Rising podcast, hosted by Mike Toffel, chair of our Business and Environment Initiative, showcases path-breaking ideas, such as how to use artificial intelligence to help mitigate risk and optimize opportunities for supply chain logistics in the face of extreme weather events. My hope is that we can all rise to the challenge of this moment, drawing on the many unique strengths of Harvard Business School to learn, innovate, and lead. I hope you will find your own inspiration from the work of the school, including from our many alumni who are leading ventures, spurring innovation, and collaborating within and around their organizations and communities. Together, we can accelerate positive climate outcomes and realize our mission of making a difference in the world.